So in this tutorial we want to cover how to install Drupal on HostGator through Quick Install. To begin you'll need to log into your HostGator control panel and this is typically your domain name slash cPanel and punch in your username and password on your HostGator account and once you're logged in you'll want to scroll down to the software slash services section and click on the quick install icon and from here under content management software click on Drupal and then click continue and the application URL is where quick is where quick install will install Drupal for you um, if you leave this blank it will be installed to the root of your account uh, not a good idea if you already have a website set up there so in this case we want it to be demogator.hostgator.com slash my Drupal um, and admin email make sure that's a valid email address because your password will be sent there app version we'll leave it to 6.2 it's the latest as of today's recording manual install no we want it to be an automatic install site name will be anything you'd like for your Drupal website so in this case we'll call it my Drupal demo default time zone and automatic updates will be enabled and go ahead and click install now and what quick install is doing it's downloading Drupal it's setting up your databases and configuration files so everything will work right out of the box let's give it a few more seconds alright looks like things installed successfully and you can access the new Drupal website by clicking here. Now to log into our Drupal admin, we'll put in the username admin and the password was emailed to us, so check your email for that. Click login. And now you're in the Drupal account. So to create a a um, a test article, click on create content and in this case we'll create a page and name it whatever you like scroll down to the or go up to menu settings and let's call this first page and under publishing options Let's promote this to the front page of our Drupal website and click Save. All right, now it's created. So if you go to, in your browser, you'll see that your first page is there. If you click on Home, you'll see that it's been created. Now if you click on Administer, you can see all the options in Drupal. And if you scroll down to site configuration and click on administration theme you can change your default theme here and under site building you can change the website theme to any of these or you can install others let's enable this one set it to default the blue marine and click save configuration and you can see that's now been updated and there it is on your site